good morning. Welcome to this edition of the 401 Talk Zone radio show right here on YouTube. My name is Leon Jones. I am in the Walmart in Frankfurt, Indiana. And I was picking up some Cheetos and I found this. Look, they've gone too far out of the way to celebrate a month that 80 to 90 percent of these individuals were molested. Now, I'm not going to buy this, but I'm going to show you what's really going on here. So, they had Juneteenth ice cream, and now they have the Celebration Edition Pride ice cream. Look at this. They have gone really crazy with this, and I'm going to tell you this. My respect for a number of them has been lost. I mean, they get everything. And I just want everybody to know, check out your Walmart and look in the ice cream section. And for me, I don't even believe their ice cream products are worth it. Now, they've taken this Pride Month, they put it in there with Father's Day. You have the feminists out there who want Father's Day abolished because it's offensive to same-sex couples and of course single mothers all bullshit now for me guys gals if you want your sanity we got to stop this madness i mean look at this pride ice cream got the, the, the celebration edition i'm not celebrating this this is all nonsense so again I'm just giving you an idea of what's going on out here this is very bad you know come in on a Saturday seeing this so I I had to put this out there because I don't even know what Pride Month is but putting this out there is really giving people who have sexual orientation all this power and they make up a, a very small minority population again I'm not knocking what people do with their lifestyle don't get the children involved but Walmart you actually going overboard with this pride ice cream I mean look at this you can see it right here pride ice cream this is ridiculous and I'm just telling you all, man. Oh, beware of what you're buying out here. Again, I had to put this out here. Take a look at it for yourself. This is called Pride Ice Cream. Now, I'm going to tell you, this is not something I would buy for the family. What happened to regular ice cream? Now we have to have Pride, and there was one earlier that had Juneteenth. I don't celebrate Juneteenth, and you see what happens when we have somebody who's a puppet in office like Joe Biden. Pride ice cream. This is so ridiculous. Well, I'm not going to buy it. I'm going to post this up. Tell me what you all think about this. Is this another sin? I believe it is. But in the meantime, you millennials out here, you believe in a lot of this shit. Me as a Gen Xer, no. There's enough victimization going on, but subjecting yourself to pride ice cream during Father's Day, fathers only get one day a year, our job is basically thoughtless, but we give gays, lesbians, we give the alphabet community more respect than Father's Day. Again, this is what happens when you include Pride Month. And at the end of the day, just tell me what you think. Pride ice cream, Walmart has awakened 
too much. And I just want you all to know, be careful what you buy. Because this makes no sense. Thank you for listening to this edition of the 401 Talk Zone Radio Show. Walmart. Need help? No, I don't need help. I'm putting this on my YouTube channel here. Oh, what is it? Pride Ice Cream. <laughs> yeah. Pride Ice Cream. All right. Well, you done. Sorry about that. Yeah, thank you. Well, again, on a Saturday, this is what happens when uh, the devil comes into the big corporations. Thank you for listening to this edition of the 401 Talk Zone Radio Show. Till next time, my name is Leon Jones. I want you all to have a wonderful and gracious day. God bless you. I'm out. <laughs>